So we'll go ahead and get started. Um, the type of home ownership you have, are you renting or owning? I'm renting right now. Okay. <laughs> type of structure, single family, detached, multi-unit townhome? Single family. Approximately the date you moved in? July this year. Okay. Uh, have you always lived in Houston County? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Can you tell me how your um, family ended up in Houston County? Um, you know, my mom's family is from here or around here, as far as I know. Um, dad's dad was Air Force. So your granddad? Mm -hmm. Yeah, he was Air Force, ended up here. Um, I think when my dad was still young. Mm -hmm. They retired here and just stayed like a lot of people do, I reckon. Right. You know how many ser uh, years of service your granddad was in, in the Air Force? Oh, a lot. He was a uh, lieutenant colonel. Oh, he was uh, he was officer. Yeah. Um, I don't know exactly, but it was... Was it over 20 years, you think? Yeah. Okay. That's awesome. So, can you tell me a little bit more about the structure of your home? Like three bedroom, two bath, single, shingle? Oh, um... Four bedroom, two bath, brick, shingle roof. What's the square footage? It's right at two. Two thousand. Mm -hmm. Okay. So do you have rooftop solar on your home? No. All right. So tell me why you do not have rooftop solar. Uh, did you make that decision or was it already made for you? I mean, it's a rental house, so... I mean, I assume if they wanted it, they would put it on there. Okay. If you had the option, would you put rooftop solar on your home? Um, <clears throat> I probably have to look into it first. I don't okay. know too much about it. I mean, aside from the obvious, it's solar panels on your rooftop, so it's to cut down on your electricity bill. You know, good for the environment, all that jazz. But as far as um, the practical... How much is it going to cost up front? How much does it cost after that stuff? I don't know anything about. So what would you like to know about maybe to help understand what exactly solar panel is? I mean, I, I mean, I get the idea behind it. And mm -hmm. I, I get what Like, would you think like classes or more information? Like, what you're talking about, like, the electricity and the money and installation? Yeah, I mean, it would come, I mean, for me... Um, the family and everything would come down honestly to how much it costs. Okay. That pretty, would pretty much be the bottom line. Or... Okay. So maybe advantages and disadvantages mm -hmm. as well? No, yeah, definitely. Okay. So I'd like to talk a little bit about rooftop solar adaption in general. So here's a map of the United States. Can you check or put a star on where you think there is rooftop solar at. Where I think it's at? Mm hmm You can put a star. Uh, specifically? Check. Yeah. Like, check the um, states. You could circle them. Mm. Mm. I honestly, if it was me, I'd guess, um, along the outside near the coast and everything. I mean, here, California, definitely. Mm hmm I'd say, I'd say these two and these two. And then I'd probably say, um, how many you want me to check? However many you would like. There's no right or wrong answers here. I mean, I'm sure some states have, there's at least some in all states, but as far as, I guess, where they would use a lot, mm -hmm. I guess it would be really dependent on probably the weather. I mean, I guess I would say these would probably have them the most. Mm hmm and then maybe some up here on the coast. I don't really know. But okay. I would, that, if I was guessing, I would just guess those. Oh. Just because of the weather. Yeah, that's a good state. So we got <laughs> California, Arizona, New Mexico, Texas, Florida, and we got what? South Carolina, South Carolina and Georgia. Georgia. Okay. I mean, that's just the ones I would guess. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. And so why? what makes... Um, like those states that you just checked off and put an X beside, different from where you're from in Houston County. Well, I'm sure that I mean in Georgia, mm -hmm. from where we're from, I'm sure there's a lot that use it. I imagine probably 
I imagine probably in a lot of these, I would imagine if they use solar, it's probably a commercial mm-hmm. as opposed to like a residence having it on the roof. Mm-hmm. Uh, maybe some more, maybe, I mean, more out west, like Texas and, and California, then maybe they have more up on the roof of houses and stuff. But I ain't never been out there, so I don't know. But what they just, you- um, as far as California goes, they just seem to be a little more. I guess forward thinking with stuff like that, uh-huh. maybe more conscious of it, more willing to uh, be proactive about it. I guess switch to stuff like solar and everything. Um, mainly because I don't see it on. Not that I really probably don't pay attention to it too much. I don't really see it a lot here in, in Georgia. I imagine it's a lot of businesses, maybe up in the metropolitan area. Oh, okay. That's good that you mentioned. Yeah, that's good that you mentioned that. Now we're gonna look at the state of Georgia. (laughs) (laughs) And Al, you can go ahead and you can circle or put an X beside what counties and area you think. I mean, honestly, I'd pick all. I'd pick these big cities because I think it's all. And you can circle around how you want to do it. I'd say all these around like Fulton, Cobb, and all that. Mm -hmm. Maybe Columbus. Um, I say definitely Savannah and Augusta. Mm-hmm. And Athens, and I imagine there's some in Macon, but again, I think it's probably businesses. But I think stuff like that is going to stem from the the bigger cities when it starts out, anyway. Okay. And then kind of spread out from there if it catches on. Okay. So, what makes the areas that you circle, like the Metro Atlanta, Augusta, Macon, Columbus, and Savannah areas, different from Harrison County? Well, it's just, um, I mean, making in Houston County ain't really that much different anymore as far as size and stuff goes. But, mm-hmm. I mean, for up here, I mean, there's obviously maybe more money, more initiative in the bigger cities to um, to push something like that forward, I guess. Mm-hmm. I mean, you see um, things in and around Houston County, like you see little, I don't know what you call it. Field with the solar yes uh-huh. panels in them. I mean, right. You can see them here in Houston, too. Right. Um, but like I said, I assume that's mostly commercial or right. stuff like that. Okay. Anything else you would like to talk about yeah. as far as with the solar panels? Anything want, else you'd like to add? What you want to talk about? I was just saying, you know, anything else you'd like to add? <laughs> no, I, mean, I really don't have, I really don't have uh, too much knowledge on mm-hmm. it actually... Um, like I said, it'd be something, <clears throat> like for me personally, I'd have to look into mm-hmm. how much it costs, um, what the what the benefits of it are, mm-hmm. and then, the, I mean, the other stuff I just get from. Not something I've really thought about that much. Okay.